What up, world? It's your boy, Next Stop Search City. Yo, what's up, guys? It's your girl, Anita. And welcome back. Another week of that food we watch. Wait. <coughs> the food we watch podcast. <laughs> Anita coming in for the save. Thank you, back. Thank you all for coming back to the food we watch podcast. Um, another week in the books. Um, another crazy episode, episode of Master Chef. I was sitting here like, what is going on? It was wild. People were doing stupid things. We're going to get into it. And from what I heard from the streets, Nita got something to say. So she going to be running this thing for real because she got something to say. I do. But before so we you, get started. So you can ahead. chime in. So you can chime in. I'll you. chime in where I fit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just a brief introduction of the episode. It was a team challenge at Dodger Stadium, and they had to cook for over 100 kids. Just a breakdown. It was a blue team and a red team. Blue team uh, was composed of the north and the south. Mm-hmm. And the captain was sad. Well, well northeast, you got to be specific. The northeast, you are correct, mm-hmm. and the south. And then the red team was the West and the Midwest, mm-hmm. and the captain was James. And this mm-hmm. things happen, and we can get into it. I don't know. Again, I don't know what you want to say. Well, I just to do that brief introduction. Well, cap. Well, captain of the red team was James, and captain of the blue team was was Savannah Sav, as they call her. Um, since Kobe won the last challenge and had the elimination. Uh, he made a trade, and he chose to trade Kennedy. Um, he, oh, I'm sorry. He chose to ch- trade Bren off of his team for Kennedy. Mm-hmm. Um, apparently, Kobe and Kennedy, they made a pact to look out for each other. I saw that. Mm-hmm. Oh, I got a license. Yep. <laughs> um, but real quick, though, with the captains, the judges actually chose the captains because mm-hmm. they really wanted to see what they can do and. Boy, I was disappointed. Mm. Um, so the first hiccup was well, Nina. Quick, did you want to tell them what they had to cook? Well, I was gonna get into that. Can I just tell them what the, not what they cooked, what they have to cook for the kids? Yeah, they had to cook for kids, y'all. What no, was you what right. was y'all cook for kids? That's each the question. Team had to make a basket of food, it had to contain a protein, a fried side. A slaw and some kind of sauce. Oh yeah, but you want to go into what the team? Well, okay, it's, we got we, we got to kind of like get it. Okay, it's up to you. I can so, tell you what they cook. I got that written down. <laughs> so the blue, the blue team. What did they decide to make? Oh my god. Okay, so the, the, the first time, the first time, not the final product. What was the first? What's the difference? There is a difference. So. <laughs> Huh. The blue team, they well, I guess it's I guess it is the and same. They didn't change anything. <laughs> Maybe that's the problem. They didn't change. They made uh, a grilled chicken sandwich with a carrot and cabbage slaw, French fries, and a fry sauce. Okay, that's well let's team made. Well, well, let's get into it. Mm. Okay, number one, Nina. She needed mayo for her coleslaw. Well, Kennedy used up all the coleslaw for the sauce. That was salty. Like before, I use up all of the all of the thing. I'm a I'm we on a team. Something. Hey, does anybody need any, any of this before I start using it? But I mean, one would think so with coleslaw. Well, no, because there are different. She th- like she said, there's vinegar based coleslaw. So she thought. But what kid? Oh, wants to that's eat what I was. And in my mind, I was like, who the heck? Is, I'm like, not serving like, no vinegar. And coleslaw. I don't want to eat, and I don't want no vinegar coleslaw myself. Like you have to think about your audience, and mm-hmm. that's what Nina was saying too. She was like, "No kid wants to eat a vinegar based coleslaw. Like, come on, they want mayo." Well, look, they, they they weren't thinking her. about the kids anyway because you decided to make a grilled chicken sandwich. Even Gordon was so, like, "Okay." <laughs> so let's get into it. I probably would have fried it. Sab stated um, that. They chose not to fry it because of the, fr- fries. Of the fry stations, and they were making French fries out of that. However, Gordon came around and was just pretty much like, I don't think this is a good idea. Kendall, 
I was like, Kendall, this is gonna bite you in the butt. A reverse. He senior. was like, he was like, I won, I've won awards for this. I know what I'm doing. And I'm da, a real master. I think I got this. Right. And no, he said no. He didn't say thank. He's like, I know I got this. I was like, Kendall is sounding a bit overconfident. And I was like, and I know that it's going to bite him in the butt. Real quick. You did not. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> You're serving a hundred kids. Kids. I don't care what you want to know more for or whatever. Like you're you're making food for kids. Like take that, like, take that out the window. And I'm sorry, staff should have stepped it up and been like, no, cut that. We need to cook this chicken differently. Sav should have been to Reagan and when she right, said right, but, we need well, to flip comes, it. That comes, so I got more comments, but okay, go ahead. All right, can I, can I so yeah. in my opinion, this all was Sav's fault and cut grilled chicken. Like, yo, I'm doing burgers. If I can do burgers, if I can't do burgers, we doing some kind of hot dog, some kind of crazy and I think hot dogs would have been dog. easier. That's what I'm saying. The fact that you come up with the idea to reverse, I've never heard of a reverse sear on a chicken. I've heard of you doing it with steak, but chicken dries out so fast. It didn't make sense. And it was grilled. Kids ain't really about that grill life. So no. if it was like a barbecue grilled burger, like chicken, oh, like, cool. I would be like, oh, that might be cool. cool. But it was cool. just a plain piece of chicken breast with cheese on it mm. so we're, we're going to touch more on that but then mm. they went to the blue team so the blue team decided to make a smash burger apple no, slaw. No, that's the red team i'm sorry the red team decided to make a smash burger apple slaw with sweet potato wedges um so then they cut back to the whoa hold on so something happened with the red team. Their food, their food wasn't done when it needed to be done. Am I jumping ahead? Okay, wait, I think I'm jumping ahead. All right. Oh, completely. <laughs> oh, okay. So back to the blue team. Sorry, guys. So Gordon came through and he was like, this dish needs to be rethought out. According mm -hmm. to Gordon, he said the chicken looks dry. The small no. looked like oatmeal. Are we talking According about? Right, to Joe, now, now I'm confused. I'm back confused. to the blue team. Back okay, blue back team. on the blue team. Yeah, okay. and the fries were a bit undercooked. A bit. They were soggy. They were soggy. <laughs> and I was just like screaming at the TV at this point. I was like, Kendall, you need to listen. And then I was like, I knew. He, I said, I, I was like, I knew him being overconfident was was gonna like mess him up and because the, the chicken sucked but he did not want to get off this chicken and then again like i said before i think sav should have overrided his decision she should have got first <laughs> yeah get him off the grill first of yes, all you get him off the grill i was like i don't understand why we're not trying to fry this because even reagan came in and was like can we fry this chicken and then she was, and then hold on, Kobe talking about some pineapple chicken. Yeah, kids ain't trying. What kid are you doing? You know, I was going to eat some. You're not cooking. For you know, adults. these are people who saying this are people who don't got. They don't got no kids. <laughs> like, oh my gosh! And then so Reagan was like, "Well, add some bacon to it." I was like, "I okay. mean, well, that was that's not call. bad." Yeah, yeah, that wasn't bad. But I'm sorry, Sav. Sav should have got him off the grill. Sav should have put somebody else on a the chicken. Then, like, think, you, you're not doing this. I think even if she left him on the grill, just tell him to grill it. That whole put it in the oven first and then grill it. Your only reason you're really doing that and you calling it a reverse sear, that's not a reverse sear. You know that chicken takes a long time to cook. <laughs> and, and you got to put it in that oven because you're trying to cook it faster so y'all can get it done. Yeah. Why y'all don't, don't choose chicken? And well, you know, the blue team wasn't the only one having issues. It was mm. the red team as well. And again, they came up with the concept of a smash burger with apple slaw and sweet potato wedges. Well, Grant 
was starting to cook the burgers on mm. the stove and then he was sticking it in the oven. Joe was like, those burgers are going to become like fossils. Like, what yeah. the heck? And then he was like, how long does it cook to take? He was like, how long does it take to cook a burger? He was like, about two and a half minutes. Then it was like, you got 45 minutes <laughs> until you have to start starving. What are you doing? Yeah. So he obviously was cooking the burgers way too early. However, that was Jane's fault because James was telling him to cook the burgers as the captain. And but but James didn't say anything. Yeah. And you can tell Grant was pissed. And even Brent was like, yo, that's on you, dog. Like you made that call. But why didn't James... no, I get it. James definitely messed up, but why didn't Grant say, I don't think we should do this? This is this early because they all look like a deer in headlights. <laughs> it was and yeah, then, both teams was just a mess. And then Gordon was like to Grant, if you start cooking those burgers now, congratulations, you lost. Yeah. So um, I guess when it was all said said and done, the burger that Grant cooked for the judges, it was cooked really good. They said it was juicy, but the wedges were a mess. And they did look a mess. They just was like cut into wedges and just was there wasn't nothing with it. And yeah. I don't know, it just it just like they just threw it on the plate. Yeah. They, they brought out a good burger, like you said at first. So so then because James started started feeling the pressure, he decides to pull Bryn off the fries. She was already working on the fries. She decides to, he decides to put Bryn on the burgers. She's telling him, I do not feel confident grilling these burgers. Like, she was like, what do you want me to do? And James is looking like a deer in headlights. James, it's like, yo, why James would you put somebody lost. who expressed that they don't feel comfortable doing this? Why would you assign them that task? And of course, what happens? search the burger when it went when, when they were about to go serve the kids the burger was oh, ice cold you skipped a whole bunch what about the blue team's taste test oh uh, I, was, I was i was going to get there they went back to back <laughs> you started to talk about serving okay well give me so the burger ended up being ice cold and raw. And I, I did. They 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 told they told the blue team to rethink their Westman call. No, they told him they told him the cabbage tasted like oatmeal. I already said that. Uh, oh, you said that. Okay, yes. my bad. Sorry. Yes. Keep continue. So Gordon literally told the kids who were who were trying to get their food from the red team, he literally told them. Just go over to the blue team side and get and start with the blue team first because the it red was, team didn't have their food together because it, it was, was raw. It was raw. <laughs> yes. yeah. And it and it came from Bryn's tray. But however, she warned James. She was like, James, I'm I don't feel comfortable with this. And yeah, he he didn't he didn't listen. She was yeah. like, This is not my thing. And then the red team just kept crumbling and crumbling and crumbling. Bryn just couldn't get it together. So then um, James, like, they was just like, can someone else get on a grill? Because it was very obvious. Bryn was like, I can't do this. This is not my thing. And I forget I forget the boy name. Um, he's really good with the um, I forget what style. It's, it's one of, uh, his, one name, of, his name is Charles. Thank you. He was like, do you want me to get on a grill? Like, because James was asking around, like, can somebody grill? Can somebody grill? And no one was saying anything. But my thing is, well, then if nobody was stepping up to the plate, James, why weren't you? You're That's why I was confused. Leader. He didn't yes. cook anything. He just stood up there. Like they said, he was playing with the kids and all yes! that. Right? Was they were that. so annoyed with him. He was up there doing they a Dougie. Were so, <laughs> they were so annoyed, and so was I. And then, not only that, he tried to pull MD off 
she was doing the fries and he was trying to pull her off and she was like i'm doing the fries james you suck as a leader you suck yeah we clearly um and james is was the guy like yeah i got him i had him because we saw first saw him like oh james that's what's up um hopefully you know he does something good he's a, like they said he's a good chef and they wanted to see if he can actually does he have a voice and he actually does it he was just no, he lost start to finish and and again wh why wasn't he cooking anything <laughs> and to be honest with you wayne was the one who stepped up wayne delegated grant said yes, it he he's like, I, I, he's like, I was more clear when i heard wayne speak because outside of that james isn't saying anything he's not telling us what to do yeah that was very weird sorry but, james. yeah and i mean the, the the chicken fiasco some of the kids complained that the chicken was dry one mm -hmm. kid said it tasted like dust, dust. in their that mouth was, yeah Oh my God! That's I nasty. said, "Wow!" I was like, "Yeah, it was a bad call, Sav. You should have." I don't understand. I don't know if it's people pleasing or what, but if you know if something doesn't sound like a good idea, I'm gonna need for if they do another group team challenge, I'm gonna need for these leaders to be like, "No, no. we're not doing that." Yeah, exactly. We're not doing that. That's not a good idea. No, that's not a good idea for this challenge. Yeah. Again, hot dogs, my goodness, would have been so easy. What child doesn't like a hot dog? I was exactly. with my niece the other day, and she wanted what? A hot dog. Hot dog. <laughs> and she got a hot dog with fries. Like, so simple, so easy. Like, you're not cooking for adults. You got to keep it simple with kids. Yeah. Point blank, period. Uh, but anyway, um, so I put Kendall is, oh, oh my goodness. So this part. So, yeah, so Reagan decided to help Kendall with the chicken. Gordon, so they're like running behind now. Kendall's mm -hmm. running behind with the chicken. Gordon is like, when is this chicken going to be done? It was like radio silence for a while. No, they, no, at first, they kept saying two minutes, two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. And it's not two minutes. It's been it past two, two minutes. minutes. Right. And when Gordon came over, there was like, he's like, nothing. I ain't saying nothing. <laughs> He say they I'm not going I'll lie to Sam, but I'm not lying to Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> that again, the definition, you know, uh the definition of doing too much. He was actually if doing too much was a person, was that was Kendall. Kendall. Reverse see yeah. no, you doing way too much. That's Just too much grill thing. it. And your reverse seer didn't even come out right. It was too dry. So mm -hmm. awards where? What happened? What happened? You're supposed to be the master at this, right? And they asked him. They asked him, have you done this before? He said no. <laughs> so I'm like, why? Again, we said I said it in pre previous weeks. Why are you doing things you have no business doing because you've never done before? <laughs> I, feel like that needs to go in a, I feel like that needs to go in a t-shirt. That needs to go in a t-shirt. Why? Because because that is that is I feel like that has been the question, except for last week, because you know th that was beyond them. But I feel like that has been the question from mm. you every week. Why? This is not the time to try something new unless it's asked of you. Mm -hmm. You're playing yourself. So I just want to say I was really, I was disappointed in James. And it was so funny because when it was all said and over, like James was like, good, good job team. And Gordon was like, what did good, he say, sir? Good job, my ass. <laughs> Girl, I was like, where? Where was the good job? What are you talking about? Were you here? Obviously, you weren't here. You did not see what happened. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Or you in denial, because that was not a good job. So, Clearly. yeah. So, I, uh, 
I would say I was disappointed in James. I was disappointed in Kendall, and I was disappointed in Sav. I yeah. was I was disappointed because it did not have to be like this. Like, stop being overconfident. Stop thinking you know everything. Stop doing first time things on this show. Mm -hmm. This is not the time to be doing that. Um, again, unless it's asked of you. Exactly. So, because the chicken sucked so much, the red <laughs> team <laughs> ended up winning. <laughs> said the chicken sucked so damn much. <laughs> yes, since it did, the the um the red team ended up winning. Um, Sav, Kendall, and Reagan ended up being on the bottom, even though I did not agree. With yeah, Reagan on the bottom. Reagan should have not been there. It was not Reagan's fault. She At was all. trying to help. She trying that to help and told them to switch it up. Yes. So I did not agree with that. I did not agree. It should have been Sav and Kendall. And I'm sorry if it was up to me, they both should have went home. I was thinking because you had texted me earlier, and I was like. Is this like a double week? Like, what's going on? <laughs> but you, you're right. Uh, like you said, Sav, Kendall, and Reagan. Reagan by default because she was on the team. They ain't had nobody else. I know they do three people. But, um, yeah, this week I would have just been like, nah, we doing two. And it's y'all y'all two. And guess yeah. what? Y'all two go go home. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Yeah. But um, at the end of it, I mean, the person who went home, this is the thing. I was up in the air with it, kind of like they were saying. It was like, I get that Kendall didn't execute, but Sav had the idea to create something that they pretty much should have known that kids wasn't going to like. Yeah. Red Team literally wasn't better. It's just like, kids, it's a burger. So, yeah, I know. <laughs> so I they were going to win. Think, I, I think, honestly, if they would have done like a hot dog, it would have been different. They could have had it in the bag, to be honest but, with you. Um, all in all, it's been a long time coming. We've seen it in the last... He had, like, one good week. He did. He had one good week. But over and over, it was just... He was getting saved. He was getting saved, and it was a lot of mess-ups. But this week, he could not get saved. We had to say goodbye to Kendall. And I'm sorry, he is to blame for his downfall. And I hope he learned, don't be overconfident. Have you not seen? Look at what happened to Jennifer. She was overconfident. Mm -hmm. Even she had to get humble. Don't be overconfident. And don't do things you have not done. And done. And again, that happened to Jennifer. She ain't ever did nothing like that before. Overconfident. No, you talking about... No, that, that week when she... Was on the oh, bottom. Oh, she was at the three. bottom. Yeah, yes. right. I'm saying it, this is literally the same and the, scenario. The prior to that, the, uh, the Midwest, I forgot her name. What's her Carol? Was that her name? When she did the uh, the the roulade, never done it before. And oh <laughs> yes, yes, that's at her home. So we got to stop, guys. Listen to me. I get that you're on a competition. You're trying to win, and you want to stand out. I think it's okay to do like minor things that you haven't done before, but when you're doing whole things, a whole process that you haven't done before, like Nita said, if it has not been asked of you to do it, do what you know and just elevate it, but do what you know <laughs> so you don't end up in these situations. Yes. That's just my advice. Yes. And it, it kind of sucks because, you know, you proclaim to be the grill master and, the grill, is what sent, and the grill is what sent you home. <laughs> That's so messed up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the thing you mastered was your downfall. Wow. I didn't even think about it like that. Dang. Yep. <coughs> to the limb. <coughs> to 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 Lou. All right, but again, another hectic week. Did you see the previews for next week? I did. They got this. Bring, yeah, some army guy. Like, and that's they're going to make dishes out of rations. That's too small. Too small. He needs some ice. 
nigga, you swollen. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like, oh no. It's like, how, it's like, how can you move? Like, you always got like this. I think it, I don't know. Hey, some people like but, yeah, but yeah, they gotta cook with army food. That's gonna be interesting. Now see, yeah. now see, now see that I will give you a pass because I'm sure none of them have ever cooked with army food unless unless somebody done served in the army. Mm-hmm. But that's what I'm saying. See, now it's asked of you to do something new. So that's yeah, the like- difference. Like the baking competition, I'm not mad at Kyle right. last week that he lost. He doesn't bake, so right. <laughs> it's not. They asked you to do something you didn't do. That's something right. different, right? Right. So, but to me, learn here, guys. Don't be overconfident. It don't matter how many times you done did something. When it comes to this competition, it's a different ball game, mm-hmm. and. Don't cook what you never cooked before if it's not asked of you. I mean, it's, it's that simple. I approve this message. <laughs> but guess what, guys? This has been another episode, another week of the Food We Watch podcast. Let us know in the chat. We haven't done this, but maybe we should do this before we go. Right now, do you have any front one runners for possibly going far in this competition? I think Reagan. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, this is what I wanted to say. The South, because Kendall went home, the South finally lost a person. They needed to lose a person. You is think that, so? That it, it? Or oh, no. the mic, the mic. Yeah. Oh. Why? Why do you say that? Why? Why did they? Kendall kept that? messing up. Oh, got you. Oh, yeah, got you. He was going to yeah. go eventually. He just kept getting saved. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yep. So they finally lost their first person. So everybody's so, lost a person now, right? Mid- yeah, yeah everybody. Every, yeah. Um, Midwest got four. South has four. Um, West. I, do they have they three? Have three, I, I believe. And we have mm-hmm. two. Yeah, Northeast have two. Or what yeah. Northeast has two. Yeah. Um, so I think Reagan, I think I think she's a great cook. Um, and like you don't I feel like she's too though, right in the middle, but like you don't like she hasn't has yeah. she been that for a bad dish? Exactly. So I think Reagan, um, I feel like Wayne is somebody to watch out for. Um, especially what he showed us with that nine-layer cake. Woo! Mm-hmm. Um, I think Kennedy is a force to be reckoned with. Um, anybody else? I, 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 I don't. I, I like. I, don't I like. I like Bryn. I like I, Bryn. I, I like just this don't. week. I don't blame her for none of that. But yeah, last I week, I don't, don't either. She did. She's, She's she's one of the only ones left for the Northeast, so I got you got it. <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying to hold on, but Bren, I think is is can can be strong. Um, like you were now. Here's the thing: I don't see Reagan at all in these episodes. She's one of those ones I like talked about before, where it's like, oh, no, <laughs> not even like next week. Was she highlighted really in the previews? Like this is the most she talked. I've seen her talk this week. Well, 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 well. Hold on, mind you, editing. Yeah, she might be saying a lot, but the producers aren't focusing too much on her right now because yeah. I guess she's not she's not doing anything that's outstanding. Yeah, she's that middle. She's the what's yeah. that? What's her name? MD MK. MD MD. You got MD James was one of those. Well, you know more about. Well, MD had her first bad dish, so they kind of well, yeah. That's what they, they highlighted her because she did something bad. She people are teetering in the middle. Team line pie. <laughs> the people that are teetering in the middle, I think they're starting to highlight more. Like last week was MD. This week, James. You don't really hear from him. But now that's why did. they called him out. Reagan. Sav. Yeah, they, Sav. So, yeah. um, but. Charles, Charles, I really don't see yeah, yeah, that. Is his, true. First, his audition was I great. Know, I, was I know, that is true. Um, last yeah. week, also Kobe. Kobe came out of nowhere last week yeah. and won. 
But yeah, like you were saying, those top people, Wayne to me is like he's supposed he, to be working with. He he's probably top in my own, like in my list of going far. Mm-hmm. Like he's one of the ones like I don't think he he would he would have to lose. Like he would have to do something crazy. To, <laughs> but if he keeps being consistent, I think he can he can mm-hmm. go far in my book. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But uh, now, I want. Go ahead. Now, now, who do you think is not going to last much longer? I don't Man. think I don't think MD. What's the chick? What's the chick name on? Oh no, I'm not going. to <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> No, say yeah. it. MD. <laughs> no, say it. Uh, on um, on the, the Northeast. No, I think Nina is pretty consistent. So, so and Brand is say? consistent. I'm trying to figure out names. I don't. <laughs> no, go ahead. What, what, what region are they in? I don't know. I just, I don't have. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I don't know. Um, um, James, I'm gonna say this, James. Unless he pull out some great dish next week, James is on notice. James is um, definitely on notice. We're trying to think who else. I, oh, Jennifer's still there. I forgot about Jennifer. There's so many people. <laughs> I know. <laughs> She's There's a strong. Brand. I think this the strong team, the strongest team now is it's the South, South because they got rid of Kendall. So the <laughs> South is just like, <laughs> I think the South is, is chilling right now. Uh I think they got it. Um, and Wayne is carrying the Midwest. Uh I don't Wayne even know is. Kennedy is in the West. I think so. Kennedy. I think it's Kennedy Olivia. Who's Olivia? Mm. I know. Uh, Lizzie. Lizzie. I'm sorry, Lizzie. Making up names. <laughs> I'm, sorry, I'm like, oh, like, wait a minute. I definitely ain't here about that. I'm sorry. Lizzie. So West is James, Lizzie. And Kennedy, I and think. Kennedy. And M- a- ain't MD the West? Oh wait, then I might I might be wrong. No, Kennedy is mid. Mm. No. Ain't she from Colorado? No, <laughs> she from Hawaii. <laughs> no, not MD. Kennedy. Kennedy is is from Colorado, ain't she? She was. She's definitely not Midwest. So she's the West. She, she, cause she was going against them, so she's definitely the West. I might have it wrong with Lizzie. Nah, no, Lizzie is the West. Me. She's from Alaska. So do they have four too? I think they do. Oh dang! So everybody has four. So it's four, 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 and then two. Yeah, because <laughs> the Midwest. <laughs> they only no Midwest lost two. Did they? They lost the chicken roulade lady, and then they lost Kyle last week. Oh yeah! So they got three. Three. Okay, okay. So South has four, West has four, Midwest has three, and Northeast has two. Boom, we figured it out, guys. I know <laughs> this is how we talk. This is literally how we be talking. We be on the phone. <laughs> literally how we figure it out. Like, all right, I'll just talk it out. Mm-hmm. Um wait, so who was she gonna say? That's not gonna oh you for oh you forgot what she looked like. I don't be know all these people's names. Well, I already, I mean, how I many? I just said James. <laughs> <laughs> I remember him for this week. Um, I, I don't know Reagan, so I'm going, I don't want to say I, Reagan. I think, I think Reagan is a strong competitor. We got to, I, really I haven't seen though. anything. But so. she hasn't made a bad dish. MD, I'm not, I'm not, after the previous week, it was like, oh, wow, okay. Um, I don't think she's gonna last. What about Charles? Here's the thing about Charles. I know he can cook good. They just because he he had a couple dishes that they looked at, like you know how they walk around before they pick the people. Yeah. That I was like, like when he did that week when he took the gizzards and the inners. I, yeah. I wanted them to try that, <laughs> like, and they didn't. So I don't know. I don't know. But, well, you know what. Because again, it was just a preview. It wasn't the whole episode. Maybe some people whom we didn't really hear from, we might hear from this, I mean, next week with the army food. 
Yeah, so right now I'm pretty much up in the air with who's not going last because, again, some of the people that's been on the top has been pretty much the consistent each week, yeah. we, we know, and that's how we know their name. The people that's really been in the middle. Or if you know, they've been in the bottom, that's how we know their names. And I know too. the bottoms. We know the <laughs> bottoms because they're all going now. Kendall, Richie, <laughs> Chicken Rule Eye Lady. Like, Kyle was the only one that was like, oh, I can't believe it, but that that was the luck of the competition. But everybody else, you were like, yeah, I kind of saw that coming. So we'll see, though. You guys watching this in the chat, comment. Who do you think is a strong competitor that you see going far? And who do you think see and not last in the next couple of weeks? Let us know in the chat. And, yeah, we would greatly appreciate it. Also, please like, share, follow subscribe to the normals be chefing platform on youtube uh your views your contribution is greatly greatly appreciated before we get out of here nita do you have anything else to say about this week's episode no, of Master I said everything i needed to say you definitely did you said a lot thank you for carrying this episode yes. <laughs> before we get out of here how can the people find you Guys, you already know. Just hit me up on Nita Dafu photo on Instagram and Facebook. And what about you, search? Uh, you know where I be at. I be all up in the IG, mainly all platforms, but I be all up in the IG. So you can hit me up on at search city on all platforms. But if you don't find me over there, I be chilling looking at recipe videos over at normals be chefing on all platforms. Before we get out of here, you already know we got to let you know that good things come and good things go. Kendall. Oh, shade. <laughs> Life is like a box of chocolate. <laughs> that shit be melting. Ash throwing shade. That's crazy. <laughs> Boom. That's funny.